Hey everyone, it's Kenya and welcome back to my channel. So I'm back at it with another week review. And this particular week came from Royal Impressions Hair Store on Amazon. So they basically sent me this 13 by 4. I want to say it was like a 22 inch loose wave wig. And I absolutely loved it. So if you guys are interested in watching me install this wig and give you guys a light detailed review, then keep on watching. So this is the natural curl pattern. It was basically a loose wavy texture. Now it did come with um, three combs, well, four. So a middle comb, a top comb, and a side comb, and a bottom comb. So right now what I'm doing, I'm just going to apply three layers of glue. I'm not gonna show you the whole process of me laying the glue. Well, the three steps of the glue, but you guys get the point. So, now I'm just gonna take my little stick, my popsicle sticks. I like to use my popsicle sticks, you guys. I'm gonna take my popsicle sticks and I'm going to spread out the glue evenly on top of my cap. It don't come for me fanning my um glue. I forgot my dryer this day and you know. So now I'm just about to take my ebon spray. Like I really like this ebon spray. So basically for a scroggle hole, I put the ebon spray on top of my glue. And I just spread it out with my fingers. Okay, so now basically I'm just going to lay my lace into the glue. I'm just going to align everything up with each other and I'm going to simply just lay my lace into the glue. And you can see me adjusting the wig and stuff, just making sure it wasn't down too far. Like I have a widow's peak, so it's kind of weird. And now I'm just going to adjust my side tails. Now I can say the side tails were kind of short on me. I didn't cut them off or anything. I did cut, but it still was kind of snug, but it is what it is. I made it work, you guys. It wasn't that bad, but I would prefer more side cap. And I ain't gonna lie, doing this on myself, I'm not. I'm not gonna say I'm not a pro because I am kind of a pro at it. But I'm a little risky. Then plus I'm working with these long nails. But let's get back into the video. So now I'm just about to take my got to be holding spray, and I'm going to spray on top. So I spray under the bottom with the other spray, and I spray on top with this spray. And I like to take my elastic band after I do this method and tie down my lace. And I typically leave my band on for about 10 to 15 minutes. So now that my band is nice and secure, I'm just going to find something else to do. And you know. Now I am taking my mini scissors and I'm snipping like a couple sections, a couple sections to um, cut off my lace. I like to cut off my lace with the razor, but I'm not gonna lie, this was quite tedious trying to do it on camera. Plus, I was recording my tiny ass bathroom. I called myself pre doing everything to make this video easier, but no, it didn't. I had to end up redoing it all over, and I really hate doing baby hairs on myself. I really feel like I didn't need them, but to give it a little pizzazz, you know, for the video and the style that I went for, I was just like, okay, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do it. But it turned out okay. As you can see, I'm struggling right now to cut off this lace with these nails, but I did it. <laughs> um, So now I'm just taking my little edge brush. And you guys, I know, I already know, but I'm going to like, keep on watching. Keep on watching. I'm gonna get it skilled. Keep on watching. Um, as far as the product that I'm using to do my baby hair, I did. I like to use a little bit of mousse mixed with the got to be gel. So now I'm taking my hot comb and I'm just combing it all to the back and just flicking it on down a little more.
Okay, now that I'm done with that, I'm just going to pull my band down and I'm going to take my brush, um, take my little makeup brush and I'm just going to define my part a little bit in a few minutes. I'm pretty sure I'm complaining about doing this lace like, girl, I was hot under these lights, like, ooh. And I'm taking this hot comb a little more, like, baby, I already, you already sleep, girl. You already sleep. But you know the girls gotta keep on giving it. Me. <laughs> Let me stop being rich. But I could have sworn I was gonna take my brush and define my part. But you know, I'm just keep on. I just I'm slicking it down, slicking it down. It's giving scalp. It's giving this your hair. It's giving perm. It's giving kiki scrape. It's giving. Oh, it's girls and her tomorrow. Period. But I think that'd be pretty good. But now I'm just about to pull my thing down, pull my band, and define my part with my brush. And I did put a little bit of my concealer on my brush. That's all I'm using to define my part. I already had pre-plugged these. See, I told you guys, I caught myself trying to do the extra steps, but I ended up having to do that stuff anyway. Like, it didn't work. I had to re-plug and everything, girl. But it's fine. It's cool. It still turned out bomb. In my opinion, and if you don't like it, you know what you can if you can exit this video. Okay, I'm just playing. But um stop what you're doing. Look at that scalp. Oh my god, look at that. But stop what you're doing and give this video a big thumbs up. You know, I actually love doing these videos and boom, look at it. Mm. A girl had got fine. I was finna go out. I was about to head out with my cousin. We was about to go have a little dinner for her birthday. Oh, look at me. Yes, ma'am. This was the next day. I had ended up putting this half up, half down. I did go take a couple pictures for the gram, for my, you know, just for the girls, for the company and stuff like that. Just showing people how versatile that you can be with the wig. And I did end up going on my TikTok and doing me a few TikToks, girls. So I may leave my TikTok below. I really don't be on there like that. But when I get bored, I go have fun on TikTok. So if you enjoyed this video, just go give me a big thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in the next